uh, kind of my version of tracking it in. A little too soft to drive in it anymore. So I'm squishing it flat like that with the three foot bucket. Ideally I'd like to pack it all down but I just can't. It's too soft. Okay, so this is the backdrop to checking this watering hole. That clip you just saw is this watering hole right here. I dug it uh, about two weeks ago, but right now I'm sitting on another uh, food plot with Curtis just a couple days ago, and we're kind of checking these things, sneaking up on them, so it's a surprise to me and you to see if there's water in them. So he snuck and saw this one before I did, and he's like, Joe, he's like, I think you should take your drone and, and go check out that other one that we just did. He goes, I think you'll be surprised. So that's the backdrop. I'm taking the drone off from another plot and I have not seen this watering hole yet after we got about an inch or two of rain in this area. So let's go check it out and you'll see it through the drone eyes the first time that I saw it as well. Okay, Curtis told me that while he's uh, tilling the plot I'm standing in that I should really take a drone flight to the next plot over and take a look at the watering hole. So if, if I'm correct, it should be... Oh, there it is. Wow. That baby's looking good. He told me I'd be quite satisfied by uh, flying this one before I walk over there. This is the next one we're going to till up, but wow, look at that thing. Took a still pick for the uh, for the property owner. Wow. That is looking good right there. That's probably, I'm going to guess, two or three foot deep already. So that one I did a much better job on uh, pitching it than this first one. There's a sneak peek at the plot there. All right, now let's see if I could uh, find my way back home to the, where I'm at now. Oh boy, let's see. There, I think that's us right there. Yep. Alright, let's go check out the water hole. This one is loaded. Wow, this is a huge success right here. This is after just one, maybe an inch, inch and a half rain. This uh, is probably three foot deep right here. It's probably three foot deep. I'll have to get my measuring stick. But uh, this one obviously is getting more. All right, as I was saying, this one is obviously getting a lot more runoff. Uh, I'm gonna try and check the depth, but it's at least two foot deep right there. Maybe even three foot already. Just after one rain. Oh, that's awesome. 
and it's going to be perched right next to beauty beautiful plot right here looking good curtis okay this is plot number one the really nice and deep one take a look at this after just one rain boom there's the bottom right there that's 28 inches that's more than two feet and I don't know exactly where the deepest spot is it might be deeper yet over here but this is the one that I slicked off with the bucket because it was too soft so uh, beautiful beautiful start now let's go take a look at this watering hole. This is number two, I'm calling it. Um, this is the one I dug at the same time a couple weeks ago. And this is the largest of the two. There's an after look, There's an after look of uh, one of the watering holes. This is basically a pond. Alright, I'm out with Curtis here at what I called food plot number two. Where I dug the largest watering hole. And so far the good news is it's dry up here, although you could see where there was probably a little standing water. But uh, he figured we got probably an inch of rain here, give or take. So we're going to see if there's any water in here. And you'll see it when I do, so it'll either be success or disappointment. Uh-oh, what do we got here? Uh-oh. I see something shiny. Alright, we got some water. Alright, we have a beginning. Water. Not yeah. bad. Not bad. There's a start. For as dry as it was around yeah. here and that little shower we had, like I said, close to an inch. Yeah. And uh, I know you got a little bit more down your way. Yeah, we got already... two or three inches, but yeah. not... that's only 20 minutes from, we're only 20 minutes from each other, so. Nice. Well, let me see if this ditch worked here. All right, this first watering hole has over a foot of water in it. I didn't even think it had that much. I used the old ninja dip stick, so that's a really good start. And it's got to be well, how far across you think this is, Curtis? 20 feet? Yeah, about 20 feet wide. 20 foot across here of water. Good start. Well, somebody's using the water and hole. He sure likes it. Look at that. Instant success. Oh wait, we want deer to use it. 